All I can say is wow, y'all, wow. Can we just take a moment to say thank you? Like, thank you for something new because y'all, I am tired. I need a protective style where I don't have to glue or spray or use any type of adhesive for it to look good on my head. So, I'm excited. It's an eye part wig or a V part wig, whatever have you. Like, you're supposed to be able to wear it without leave out. But I want it to really look realistic. So I'm gonna use a teeny, teeny, teeny amount of leave outs. It's from Nadula Hair. This is the new construction of the wig. On the inside of the wig, you have these clips, you have your typical combs and an elastic band so that it's adjustable. Why my neighbor want to mow his yard right now? Like you couldn't do that another time. You had to mow right now, right now. Okay, so I know I said that I was gonna do this install with a little bit of leave out and I'm still going to, but y'all, I just have to see how it looks without the leave out. I just have to see how it looks. So we gonna see. You're supposed to do like this. I mean, it's okay <laughs> without leave outs. And I know some people that would wear it like this. I'm just not one of them. But this hair is given, okay? It's given Daddy Diana. So we're gonna see how it looks with some leave out. We are going to take the smallest little sliver And I'm just gonna leave like a little bit in the very front too because I just need it to look, I need it to look good. You know what I'm saying? Hold on now. Right now, it's not looking too bad. Now, if I was wearing it fluffy like this, then, I mean, the bling would already be done. But I'm gonna define the curls, and I want my hair to blend better with the hair, so. All right, so the curls are all defined. I feel like with a little edge control, like water and gel, like I can, like it'll do what I want it to do. You know what I'm saying? Now I'm gonna take a little bit of edge control All right, I really want it to kind of dry like this. I'm gonna clip it down like this so that it kind of dries more taut because I have a tighter curl pattern. If I just leave it up there to dry, it's gonna get really, really wavy and everything. And now I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side. Um, I think it's dry, so we're gonna go ahead and take them out and complete the look. And then the last thing that I'm gonna do, because I don't like how it falls like so close this way to the front of the face, is I'm gonna take some bobby pins 
I'm gonna pin a little bit of the hair back so that, you know, a little bit more of the hairline is exposed like that, yeah. All right, and last but not least, we're gonna lay some baby hairs because, I mean, what is a curly look without some baby hairs? Okay, so I laid a little bit of baby hair, as you can see, just baby hair on the edges just to make it look more natural, especially like if the wind blows. Like if the wind blows, you gotta be ready. Um, clearly, my hair wasn't all the way dry because as you can see, it's curled up a little bit on the edges here, but I still feel like it's a decent blend. I haven't perfected the blend, but like the top has gotten frizzy enough to where I feel like it still looks good. But once I perfect that blend, ooh, and I didn't have to use any heat. Like, what are y'all thinking? Cause I'm not gonna lie, I love it. I love it. I wasn't sure if I should feed into the hype, but they made a believer out of me. I mean, do y'all see this? Do y'all see this? 